American Pickers star Mike Wolf hugs friend in emotional moment as he works on Yawa home after Frank Fritz's death. The U.S. Sun has obtained exclusive photos of Mike, 60, working on his two lanes guest house in Leclerc, Yawa, on October 3. In the photos, Mike could be seen working on the vacation rental, which he has been restoring ahead of opening the property up for fans to rent out. In one of the photos, Mike could be seen hugging one of his workers in an emotional moment. His mother and sister, Beth, also stopped by the vacation rental at one point. Mike was hard at work throughout the day as he was seen carrying items into the home. He also walked around the property and pointed to the roof while speaking to a worker, likely discussing another renovation. Mike wore a navy blue t-shirt and jeans for the work day. First sighting. The U.S. Sun obtained the first photos of Mike on October 2, days after the tragic passing. Mike kept busy most of the day by finishing up renovations on his Iowa vacation rental. Mike's sister, Beth, could be seen helping her brother as he walked in and out of the house to grab tools and antiques from his car. Throughout the day, Mike was in a more somber mood than usual as he kept his head down. Mike then returned to his Iowa home for the evening after a long day of work. New Project Mike purchased Vacation Rental, which is 2,142 square feet, for $300,000 in December 2021. The two-story house was built in 1880 and features three bedrooms, a basement, a fireplace, and more amenities. The U.S. Sun previously revealed the renovations Mike made to the home, including painting the previous off-white building a dark green with black trimming. There is a wooden porch in the backyard with a modern black steel railing, a newly installed stone fire pit, and views of the Mississippi River. Mike also owns a vacation rental located in a historic Columbia, Tennessee building that was built in 1857. Sad Passing Mike announced Frank's passing on Tuesday morning with an Instagram post that read, it's with a broken heart that I share with all of you that Frank passed away last night. I've known Frank for more than half my life, and what you've seen on TV has always been what I have seen, a dreamer who was just as sensitive as he was funny. The same off-camera as he was on, Frank had a way of reaching the hearts of so many by just being himself. Who would have ever dreamed we would share the cockpit of a white cargo van in front of millions of people interested in our adventures? Before the show, we would take off together to places we never knew existed with no destination in mind, and just the shared passion to discover something interesting and historic. Mike's brother Robbie and Frank's co-star Danielle Colby also shared emotional tributes. Final Bow Frank last appeared on American Pickers during a March 2020 episode. He took time off to recover from back surgery, which left him with 185 stitches and two rods in his spine. During his time off the show, he entered rehab for alcohol addiction in Iowa for 77 days. Frank had a falling out with Mike, as he exclusively told the U.S. Sun in a 2021 interview. I haven't talked to Mike in two years. He knew my back was messed up, but he didn't call me up and ask how I was doing. That's just how it is. I think Mike wants to get his brother Robbie in there to replace me. I don't know why he's behaving like that towards me. Though he had been open about wanting to return to the series after his hiatus, Mike confirmed he was officially let go in 2021. The two reconciled after Frank suffered the stroke. Health Crisis Frank suffered a stroke in his Iowa home in July 2022. Frank was unable to recover from the stroke as he was rushed to the hospital four times in 2022 and 2023 for pneumonia and a seizure. Frank's close friends even filed for a conservatorship and guardianship for him in August 2022. Midwestone Bank acted as Frank's conservator, 
while his close friend Chris Davis served as his guardian. Because of his stroke, Mr. Fritz's decision-making capacity is so impaired that he is unable to care for his own safety or to provide for necessities such as food, shelter, clothing, or medical care, without which physical injury or illness may occur. Documents obtained by the U.S. Sunread. Mr. Fritz's decision-making capacity is so impaired that he is unable to make, communicate, or carry out important decisions concerning his own financial affairs. Decisions must be made for Mr. Fritz's care and placement while he continues to recover and receive treatment for his injuries. The appointment of a guardian and conservator was deemed necessary to avoid immediate harm to him. Frank's Rico Vieri. Frank was wheelchair-bound after suffering the stroke. He can walk, but he's always going to need the wheelchair because he can't walk long distances, a source previously told the U.S. Sun. Basically, you lose motion. He lost motion. A stroke can affect your left or your right side. It affected his right side. But the insider insisted Frank never lost the personality that made him a fan favorite. The source said at the time, he's the same old Frank. He has a good attitude and a great sense of humor. We crack jokes all the time. You gotta make the best of the situation, so he's come to terms with all of that. His mind is right, he's a happy guy, and his sense of humor is there. Then in his final months, Frank's condition got worse. A source exclusively told the U.S. Sun, he has been bad since the stroke, and he had been getting worse. He was unable to move the right side of his body. He needed 24-hour care. There was no way he was getting better. He was in a home. In July 2024, conservator Midwestone demanded Frank's finances be transferred to them, as the star needed skilled and long-term nursing care at the time. Remembering Frank Frank's guardian and close friend, Chris Davis, exclusively revealed to the U.S. Sun funeral plans for the late History Channel star. There will be a celebration of life in the future. It will be big. Fans can attend. We already have several bands who want to play in it, including my band. This will probably take place in the spring. Chris added of his close friend, I will say Frank loved his fans, and he passed away peacefully with friends at his side. The late afternoon sun dipped below the Iowa horizon, casting long shadows over the quiet street. Its golden hues played off the weathered bricks of an old house, one that had seen better days but still stood with dignity. For Mike Wolf, star of American Pickers, this house wasn't just another project. It was a symbol of renewal, restoration, and bittersweet memories. And today, it became a backdrop for a moment of raw emotion. Mike stood near the porch, hands calloused from years of picking through forgotten treasures, now covered in a thin layer of dust from working on the old Doa home. Sweat dripped from his brow as he paused, leaning against a wooden beam, his eyes scanning the surroundings. It had been a long journey, not just with the house, but with the recent loss that weighed heavily on his heart. Frank Fritz, his longtime friend and former co-star had passed away. The news of Frank's death had hit Mike harder than he expected. Their relationship had been complicated, filled with ups and downs like any long friendship, but their bond was undeniable. For years, they traveled the country together, rummaging through barns, old garages, and forgotten sheds, seeking relics of the past. Now Frank himself had become a memory, one that Mike wasn't ready to let go of.